So this is <laughs> Thanks. What's up, my love? What's up, sis? It's your girl Kia, and I'm back at it again with another video. So today, my nails. Shit hurt. I am going to be reviewing for Julia Hair. This shit hurt my nail. What's Gucci, sis? In the box comes just a plain old wig cap. If y'all knew how many wig caps I have, I think y'all would probably laugh. So this is a nice soft bang unit and it already came with pre, <clears throat> I was gonna say bleached. What? <clears throat> pre plus, no, what girl? Pre-cut bangs, why couldn't I just say that? But I am, I did uh, end up going in and cutting them a little bit more. This is what she looks like after the fact. She's a little kind of wonky because she was in the box, but we finna get her straight. She, this is a transparent lace front wig with soft bangs, 150% density, 13 by 4 lace front. And I think she is a 20 inch, maybe 22 if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Everything's going to be in the description box. So what i want to do is i want you see what i do I, I hate when i like try to explain what i'm gonna do but i am going to flat iron this i do want to do like a silk press so let me go get my bio silk so this is what i like to use for my silk press is the bio silk the light version um and i'm just gonna use a small small amount of the bio silk in every section so the hair is already straight but she ain't straight straight like the texture is straight already but we gotta get her in order i actually would rather take this off my head and like flat iron it should i do that yeah <laughs> So now I want to just do layers that goes, that just basically continues the bang. So I'll go straight down. If that even makes sense. Girl, I'm terrible at explaining stuff. okay now we're back she's all flattened out i ended up not using that bio silk just because 
when I got the flat iron in the hair, I'm like, it's already silky, so <laughs> maybe not. I'm gonna slide this on. One thing I did notice about the wig that I did not like, I think it's because I'm used to some of the other wigs that I've been reviewing, is that the actual knots, you know, there's a lot of wigs coming out that has like smaller knots in the front. This one doesn't, the knots look kind of big. Granted, it is a bang wig, so it's like, I mean, why do you care about the knots? But like, what if you want to pull her up in a ponytail, you know? Um, what I love about bang wigs is you don't have to glue her down if you don't want to. So, guess who's not going to just yet? Ouch, almost pulled off my lash. Okay, period, period. I like my bangs a little bit thinner than this. Cute once I do what I want to do with her. Because I am going to do a second video on this unit and it is going to be a cute little style that I think that I think a lot of people would like. So yeah, this is how she came out. After we did a little flat ironing, a little trimming, you know, a Nikki moment. <laughs> it's super flat in the top. I really like that, so... If you did want to pick up this wig, whoa, if you, wait, get it together. If you did want to pick up this wig, everything on sis is going to be in the description box down below. Stay tuned for the next video on this unit from Julia Hair, period. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.